excited about the updates to Talent Pool. Um, it includes quite a few uh, new features. Um, students can choose their own name to use, which is a big request. Students can also categorize their work. So some students might not need a full website and they can then start organizing their work. Uh, so that way it's easier to present to either potential collaborators or professionals. Um, it has Creative Commons licensing. I encourage all students to go to creativecommons.org. The Portfolio Center will be having some workshops about Creative Commons and how to use that in your talent pool profile soon. Um, and obviously the most noticeable feature is that the new design. Um, so what we're trying to do is we're really trying to push the student work a little more to the front. So it's a little more, uh, you can actually get an idea of what students are doing now. I put all my recent work up on Talent Pool and after just a week and a half since the relaunch, um, I've gotten several emails, three in about a week and a half for one was a, an invitation to an internship, one was a graduate student wanted help with a one sheet for her film project, and the last one that actually turned into a success story um, is a new freelance client of mine, and I'll be doing a design to email and a, a poster and I believe an event by, Eventbrite page for her. Um, for her new for her nonprofit and a new campaign coming up, so I'll get an email at my school account because I put my school email in the in the talent pool database, and um, it'll just say a message from talent pool, and it'll be somebody kind of explaining their project a little bit and how I can help and if they liked my work and stuff. Um, so it's been very helpful for a lot of us, especially visual design students, who can um, make our project look really pretty and put new work up, up there. Um, the interface is really easy to use, so I can, um, I can up, upload work and update my profile as often as I want. As soon as I do new work, I can put it right up there, give a little description and some keywords, and that helps um, potential employers or freelance clients contact me easily. Uh, two of the projects I worked on while I was, when I had my talent pool profile was, one was for the Chicago Fire soccer team. So they just let me know that they were looking for somebody to come out and shoot two different dates for a uh, combine for their high school. And it was pretty simple, you know, they just contacted me and me. Uh, Town Pool, I think, did a good job of kind of uh, putting it out there. Through Town Pool, I got uh, two opportunities to work with uh, two different students at school at Columbia. Um, and they were both shooting at small piece of feature stuff for their, uh, for their classes. So I got a chance to kind of further my uh, portfolio with like editing and just a little bit of uh, a little bit of that helping out a fellow student. Yeah, I definitely think it helps. Um, it's you know Columbia's own form of like LinkedIn, so 